A massive twister tore through Mangum Monday, shredding an entire home, sending debris flying through the air. You can see it just coming a little closer, and finally my husband says, we're going to have to go somewhere. Oh, my chasers. God. Right. Another tornado nearby shattered the windows and damaged the roof of this 112-year-old home and tore this building to the ground. I couldn't believe it. You left it a half hour earlier, and it was all there. You come back, and it was completely uh, demolished. One of the only things left standing from this house in Perry was a car parked in what used to be the garage. And in near Crescent, Oklahoma, these twin tornadoes spun just about a mile apart. The severe storm also brought heavy rains and hailed the size of marbles. People in La Platte, Louisiana, began to survey the damage where at least 50 homes and businesses were destroyed and gas pumps were torn straight from the ground. Fences are down, carports are gone, tin flying through the air, uh, porches are gone, but all of that can be fixed. Today I'm just saying hallelujah anyhow because no one was hurt. There are reports that winds from this storm system hit at least 110 miles per hour. There was some damage in the area, but again, no injuries reported so far. We know that crews with the National Weather Service will be out today surveying the area and the damage to figure out exactly how big and how strong this tornado was. Mireya Villarreal, CBS News, Mangum, Oklahoma. Forecasters say Arkansas, Missouri, and Illinois could see severe thunderstorms and possibly a few more tornadoes today. And just